Hello again, everyone. Steve Baker here, the voice of the Red Hawks. Welcome into our Meet the Team interviews for the 2017-18 Miami Red Hawks men's basketball program. Joining me, Darius Harper from Springfield, Ohio, year two. Yep. Here, Darius, uh, tell us how the summer's been for you so far. Uh, it's been going pretty good. I feel like I'm getting a lot better than I was last year. Mm -hmm. uh, definitely more comfortable than I was last summer. Last summer, I was just nervous of making mistakes and not really focus on getting better, but I feel like this year, mm -hmm. I feel like this year I'm little. You continued to to change the body, so to speak, mm -hmm. and get in the in the weight room, and it's really starting to pay off. Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, let's let's talk about uh, the new changes on this team. Obviously, Coop gone and his staff, and Jack Owens and and his staff now uh, in charge of things. How's that transition been for you? Uh, it's been going pretty good. I feel like Coach Owens, they came in hands on, so. It was like basically they came and picked up what uh, left off from Coach Coop and the staff. Mm -hmm. And this, this Coach Owens all the way down to uh, Coach JR. They're all hands on. They're very detailed about what, you, what they want you to do. And mm -hmm. they're very helpful in getting you better. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of new faces on this team. Seven yeah. new faces will be on the team uh, this, this fall. And you were part of a, a big class of, mm -hmm. of newcomers yourself. Tell me what you can share with those guys to say to make it easier for them in their right. first year. Um, just never get down on yourself because I definitely did that throughout the year because I was playing a lot in the beginning of the season. Then I was making a lot of mistakes and I wasn't playing, so I got down on myself. So it was hard for me to get back up to where I needed to be. So mm -hmm. I just say the season's going to be long and. You're going to make mistakes, you just got to keep going hard and practice and try to earn playing time. Yeah, and, and, and you're right because that, I mean, even sophomore, junior, senior year, there's still going to be those ups and downs mm -hmm. that you have to work through. And that, right. that's, that seems to be some of the hardest things as a young player that right. you have to do. Right. And Coach Trey, he, he gave me the best advice. He just said, it's, your freshman year is going to be a loss of up, ups and downs. He said, even sophomore, junior year, he said, you just got to stick with it. It's just about playing playing hard. That's all you can do at the end of the day. What motivates you through those times? I mean, you go back and you know, when you when you began playing, you had that inspiration, whatever it was. What gets you now? What gets you out on the floor doing the work? Uh, just the feeling of sitting the bench. I don't like that feeling because mm -hmm. growing up, I never really like sat the bench. Like, and it's just a horrible feeling. So I don't want to feel that feeling mm -hmm. again. So that just gives me the drive to to stick with it and keep my head up and give 100%, 110% every day. Talk about the relationships that you're building with those new guys and how that chemistry has started to build only even a couple of weeks in. Oh, it's going pretty good. Uh, I already knew Delonte a little bit, yeah. so me and him was kind of cool from the beginning, but it just like, just clicking from the beginning, like we're all real cool and we're starting to learn each other's strengths and weaknesses and mm -hmm. just running along with it. Very good. Obviously, college is, is half athletics and half, you know, academics. Tell me about the academic side in your major at Miami. Um, my major is family studies with a minor in criminal justice. Okay. And uh, academics here is very good. They're very hands-on if you need help. Uh, basically, if you get a, a, a degree here, you're, you're set for the rest of your future. And you've earned it. Yeah. yeah, absolutely, you've earned it. Tell me, obviously the goal for all of you guys is to play basketball beyond Miami, but mm -hmm. how do you see that, that degree from Miami in your future when the, those playing days are done? Just something that I could fall back on, something like I can have a career job that I actually like to do instead of going to a job that I don't want to do and just setting it up for my family. That, so. Mm -hmm. My family can have everything. That Any they idea want. what you'd like to do? Uh, I want to be a probation officer. Probation officer. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Um, criminal justice is that part of a family background, or is that just something that you know, uh, intrigued you? Kind of, because my mom she got her uh, major and uh, her degree in social work. Oh, so, okay. Yeah. Yeah, and I kind of grew up like around like cases of children and stuff like that and mm -hmm. just kind of gave me that motivation to do something like that. Excellent, excellent. Uh, obviously, as we talked about a lot of changes this year, what do you think this team has to do to get ready for November and those first games? Uh, just coming together, just giving 110% every day. We just got to learn how to play with each other mm -hmm. and, and so we can be ready for November since we got a lot of new faces and we just got to learn 
what are our strengths and what are our weaknesses and what we can do to make the weaknesses strengths. What are the biggest changes in those workouts uh, from a year ago? I'll just say they're more hands-on. They're more, very more detailed. Like if you do just the slightest thing wrong, they will start the whole drill over again. Yeah. And you just gotta go hard every time, no matter if you're tired or not. Okay, very good. Uh, I'll ask you the same thing I asked Logan. Uh, you know, when you obviously basketball and academics and all that takes up so much time, what do you like to do away from all of that to kind of relax and get the head on straight? Um, Sometimes I just like to sleep, mm -hmm. and I mean I like playing video games, but I'm just a guy that just like to just just chill and just like enjoy nature. So I just like go outside and just chill outside and Very good. Just All right, clear man. my head. Well, keep up the good work, and uh, looking forward to seeing you on the floor in the fall. All right, thank you. Mm -hmm.